Hello everyone, welcome to JHC Gaming, your number one source for Shotgun Legends news, gameplay, and guides. Before we start, make sure you subscribe to the channel and turn on your notifications. Enjoy the video. What is up guys, Johnny here, back with more Shadowgun Legends. In today's video, we take a quick look at the new Furious Fungus SMG. Just came out yesterday in Nitro Shop. For a thousand war points, you can get that one. And guys, you gotta keep an eye on that one. Check the perks on the shop refresh because this is a special one. So we're gonna talk about it today. We're gonna look at the stats and why it's so special. So first of all, we have a new PvP event this week. And that was a pretty big disappointment in the community, on the social medias. What the hell is going on here? What the hell is the event? What do you have to do? So it's pretty much nothing. All you got this week is extra fame for playing PvP. You get double fame for kills and double fame for assists. So that's pretty much it. Positive is it's always good to have extra fame if you're trying to unlock perks on your item. But there's no missions. There's no uh, play this way, play that way, do this, do that, and get extra war points. So I kind of miss that part uh, in the previous PvP events. I'm not a big PvP fan, but these past PvP events made me want to play, and they made me play. I remember the last PvP event, I played a lot of duels and team PvP that week because every game, every two games, you will get a free 30 war points, 40 war points just for doing stuff. And you didn't have to win and you didn't really have to perform, but you were rewarded for playing PvP. Now, if you don't care about fame that much, this event will not make you play more PvP, but there's something really cool now. The Nitro Shop have two new weapons. First of all is a shotgun, the Doom Shroom. And I didn't really check, we can check real quick, but the stats people said in the chat is kind of a clone of the Nebula. So it's not bad, but Nebula have more perks. Although the perks on weapons, they don't matter in PvP. So if you play PvP with this or the Nebula, you should have similar results. Let's check real quick, 774 the damage, 75 the fire rate, and Nebula is in the shop. 774 and 75 which is pretty much the same damage fire rate uh all three and three for the accuracy and range and then on that one a zero three and so it's pretty much a nebula with a pretty cool custom paint now the next one is an smg and it's here because i bought it already because i wanted to try it it's the furious fungus smg 123.2 damage 650 fire rate the rest is pretty standard, 07 and 8, uh, the accuracy and the range, clip size 25. So let's compare with the good SMGs in the game or the legendary SMGs that we have in the game. Let's just check the damage first, 123 damage per bullet on that SMG. Compare with Liberator, 96, that's like 20% more, even more than that, like 25% extra damage. Uh, the Plasma Blaster used to be the top SMG in the game when legendaries were buffed. 105 damage, so it's like 15, 10-15% extra damage on the new Fungus. Uh, the Winter Mule, which is probably one of the best SMGs in the game right now, 114. So it's a 10 uh, extra damage almost. And then the Kira, 96.8 also. So guys, the Furious Fungus got the most damage per bullet in all SMGs right now, if you compare with the legendaries. And then the fire rate is 650 bullets per minute. This is insanely fast. Compared to any legendary SMGs, 650, Liberator got 540, the Plasma Blaster got 500, and the Winter Mute, 550, Kira, which was the fastest at 600. So 650 is the fastest if you compare with legendaries, I mean, I know we got Pyro Spirit and other uh, stuff with like 700 per minute, but 650 is pretty nuts, okay? It's one of the fastest firing SMG in the game right now. Now, what's the downside? It's gotta have something. Like, if you bump up some stats, you're gonna bump down some stats. 0 7 accuracy is kind of standard for SMGs. Uh, 8 meters range is kind of standard also, but look at the clip size, guys. 25 bullets in the clip. If you compare with other SMGs, usually they have lots of bullets, okay? So Liberator has 40 bullets per clip. 
uh, 36 on the Plasma Blaster. It's got 35 here and 32, I think. Yeah, 32 on Kira. So the lowest of Legendary SMGs got 32 bullets in the clip and the high fire rate. This one's got the fastest fire rate and the lowest clip, like the smallest clip size, 25. So I'll show you some gameplay while we talk, guys. 25 bullets in the clip, when you fire that fast, it means rip ammo. It's gonna unload super fast and you're gonna have to reload and reload. This is Project Reload version 2.0. Now look at that, okay? When I say rip ammo, I really mean it, rip ammo. You start shooting, you already have to reload. It's like less than four seconds or around four seconds to empty your whole clip. Now, what does that mean? You're gonna have to look for extra ammo somewhere. And we know that if you get 10% mag on the weapon, it's gonna help you in PvE, but in PvP, it's not gonna give you extra bullet. So if you're gonna look for extra bullets in PvP, you need to look for something like 20% on your legs, gonna give you like four more and maybe extra on your skill tree also. We could probably bump it up to something like 30, 31, 32 bullets in the mag, maybe a bit more. Uh, if you get 10% on the weapon, it's gonna be two more bullets in PvP also. But hey, uh, you're not gonna go 45, 50 bullets here, guys. It's still gonna be a problem because of the low number you start. So for the perks, I just grabbed the first one that was in the shop today has 15 crit, 4 iron sight, and some accuracy. Accuracy is never bad on SMGs, but what I would say is this thing's pretty expensive at 1,000 if you don't play a lot of PvP. Uh, 1,000 war points is quite a lot. But I would say check the shop every refresh. I think it's gonna last for more than a week. Usually they don't rotate out the event weapons after the event. They will rotate maybe on the next PvP event or even the next one after. So I would say maybe be patient and look for maybe 10% mag on the weapon, even if it's not good for PvP. If you think you're gonna play this weapon in PvE, you might want extra bullets. Uh, look for base damage also, maybe uh, accuracy, like I said, it's not bad at all. And for the last perk, reload speed could be a good thing, or any damage perks, always good. But again, this is for PvE only. Now I will end this video with a bit of gameplay at the end, but before I leave you guys, uh, some quick talk about this weapon. People already say it's probably the best PvP weapon in the game right now because of the crazy time to kill. And again, it's gonna be depending on your playstyle because of the low accuracy. If you are gonna unload your whole clip in some guy, you wanna be at close range and you need most of your bullets to hit because with crazy fire rate like that, if you miss half your shots and you need to reload, you're not gonna kill someone, you're gonna hurt him for sure, but it's definitely for close range battles. And probably if you're facing a lot of shotgun rushers that run to you and you get that at close range, you might kill faster than the shotgun and probably end up winning the duel if you don't miss your shots. Up. So we will hear about this weapon a lot in the near future. Some guys already talk about maybe a possible nerf, I don't know. I think it's a great idea to introduce a great PvP weapon for a reason. We talked last week that some things are broken in this game, like the Nexus situation that uh, low level players have access with gold only in the shop to one of the best, if not the best weapon in PvP right now. So that could be a quick fix because now we have something really, really good and it's accessible right now for everyone, for war points and probably for a few weeks. So yeah, keep an eye on it, look at the perks. You might not wanna miss that one, guys, because uh, it's beautiful and it's performing. So we'll hear about it a lot in the near future again. Thank you guys for watching. Leave me a comment below. Did you buy it already? How you like it so far? Leave me a comment below. I'll read everything and I will be back soon with more Shadow Gun Legends. So don't forget to subscribe, leave a like if you enjoyed the video. I'll be back soon. So you made it, it better be freaking Ready close. So if you play SMG versus shotgun and you get face to face, you're gonna beat the shotgun. So if they're rushing you, this is your best defense. Yeah, the gun is epic. Uh, it's a nitro shot. All right, let's do it again. Let's do under eight. Cause I mess up at the code, I mess up at the start. We took forever to kill the the shielders. But it's not a great weapon for, for that I'm using, I think. Big 
See, I don't even kill the void crawler with a mic, but I was not hitting crit. Probably I missed some shots also. Lama. Alright, I'll switch to secondary. I just want to get a bit faster. clip on the right Shiggy Jiggy's is nice shot yeah that was pretty bad yeah, I, I never really use PvE SMGs for PvE because the range and accuracy, I think even if you get good DPS, it's still an SMG, so you're gonna fight from long range, you're gonna miss more shots, so I know some guys like SMGs in PV, PvE, but I think in the many situations, you, you want the accuracy and the range. And also, in arena, you're using your secondary, so... SMG, like... <laughs> it's not my favorite, it's not my number one choice. But it's fun to mix it up, right? But it's only, if you play arena, it's just for when you run out of ammo. You try to n not run out of ammo. So, ID, you're going again? ID disconnected? No. All right, she's gone. So let's do it. And I'm not going to fill out the elevator this time. I don't know what happened last one. I was holding the the click button. But he got in and got up. And I was not even in. Hi, uh, Sigi. Welcome to the stream. Any idea what Nino is releasing? No, bro. Watch the mad stream. It's all, all we can do, man. Daily duplicate, that sucks, man. Happened to me sometimes. long time dude i saw you on the sgl discord i think today you posted something i said what the hell this guy's still here how's life treating you man scooby king of the hill this week you still play sometimes is for is work you piece of junk
Who is it, Al? Yeah, that was faster. Let's go! Just started playing again. So what you've been doing, Scooby, with your time? Is it just too much work or you were playing other games? Because we might be looking to play something until maybe updates or... Happy birthday, broski. Thank you, man. Oh, so I get aggro, okay? So Scooby, you might want to grab that SMG uh, if you have war points. Just a quick tip. It's good. There's the first leggy of Blade Dancer runs and it's a true Patriot. And another... I said let's go on the raid. We got 716 Legendary A Squad again. Great game. And we got the damage perk this time. 10 damage, 7 elites, 13 crit. 6 mag, 5 fire rate, iron sight. Okay, let's go. That's pretty good. 